Hello. First, let me see if I get this right. Hoy yo soy Latino. Um, listen, these mini pitches um, is what it's all about. Um, we're happy at Camino mini pitch, uh, one of three we have, and I think we're going to double that number in Charlotte. Um, so as a former soccer coach for nine years, I'm very happy to be here. Um, the other thing I should just say, I should just, you know, welcome Don Garber, the commissioner of MOS today. Nick, Nick Kelly, CEO of Pepper Sports and Entertainment. Joe Labou, president of uh, soccer. My beautiful and wife who's in charge of everything, Nicole. Tomorrow, tomorrow, we're going to host a crowd of 74,000 people down in the stadium for the first soccer match in Charlotte. I'm told that is the second largest crowd in 2022 in the world. Yeah. Not in the United States, in the world. The second biggest match in the world is not in Barcelona, it's not in Rome, it's in Charlotte, North Carolina. Um, with that, I'm gonna give it to the president of our family, Nicole. Thanks, honey. So thank you all for being here. I, this is obviously about soccer and the community and the kids, but as I was inside this building for the first time today, I met a woman, her name is Maria Laura. Is she here in the, Maria? She, she did, she, where, where's Maria? Come here. Come, stand here. Here, Maria has come to this community center for herself in need, and now she works here as an employee helping others. I talked to her for five minutes, and I had tears in my eyes as she had tears in her eyes, and it made me realize that this is what it's about, her. This is what this center does it helps people it helps the community and it does such great things and she's so happy she now pays it forward and so i wanted to honor her while we're honoring the pitch and let everybody know this is the reason why we do this it's for people like you so you should be congratulated too for all your hard work and so Congratulations, Camino. I hope the kids and everybody enjoy the pitch. And I'll be back to play with you guys, I promise. And don't forget to party tomorrow night. Awesome. Thank you, Teppers. Um, there's, it takes a, a village to make things like this happen. And one of the, the key pieces of this whole puzzle is Ally Bank. It's, you see them on the jersey, you see them on this field, on the wall here. And so we have the uh, opportunity to hear from Andrea Brimmer, Chief Marketing and PR Officer of Alibank. Please give her a warm welcome as she comes up. Thanks, Dusty. Hello, everybody. Um, you know, it's hard to follow David and Nicole um, and to hear the story of Maria, but we could not be more proud to be here with you guys today and seeing all these kids with the Ally kits on. Um, really, I can't even tell you how much pride and joy that brings me. I'm a former soccer player. I played my whole life. I love the sport, and to be able to intersect kind of my personal passion with business is amazing. Uh, we've been waiting for this day for a long time. We're so excited for the match tomorrow night. 74,000 people is just incredible. Um, but at the end of the day, you know, our whole company has this ethos we believe in, which is that we're all better off with an ally in life. And it's so perfect, obviously, with our name. And these pitches are about being an ally for the community and about being an ally for the fans. And we hope you guys get an opportunity to enjoy this. I never got to play on a pitch this nice, so you're going to have a blast. Um, and I also wanted to recognize Sydney and Trees. Thank you, guys. This mural is amazing. And we're so proud of it. Um, it's a very Instagrammable moment, so get your picture taken in front of it and just enjoy. Thank you guys for allowing us to be part of this. Thank you. Thank you. 
Yeah, before we move on, can we just marvel at the mural that's here? I mean, it's incredible. Can you wave your hand so we all know who painted it? There we go. Give her a hand, everybody. It was pretty amazing. It was like last week, this was just brick on a Friday. Then I came by Monday, and it was this. It was amazing. And so just it's, it's really breathtaking. So um, what a gift it is to the community. Tomorrow night, we're going to make history. Right at the at the game, we're going to make history with this monumentally big crowd, um, and it's going to be a really special moment for Charlotte. But the, that opportunity doesn't come without a league that facilitates that opportunity. And uh, the next uh, guest that's going to share with us has had the opportunity to change history in America, right, and to to help build a new league through Major League Soccer. I had the opportunity to be a, a beneficiary as a player in it and experience what that league means and work in it. And, and so we have the very distinct honor to have MLS Commissioner Don Garber here to say a few words. Would you please give him a warm Charlotte welcome? Thank you. And I will be brief so that all these kids can start playing. You know, when we thought about how do you build a great professional soccer league in our country, we thought We've got to be aligned, we've got to be allies with great partners. And those great partners start with a great city. Uh, this is a city that has been on our radar screen for so many years. It's a rising city. It's one that represents the new America. And the new America is diverse and it's passionate. It loves the game and it loves each other. And we would never be complete until we had a team in Charlotte, North Carolina. But in order to do that, we needed to meet David. And uh, David and Nicole have had a passion about giving back to this community through sports and obviously doing it now through this great soccer team, Charlotte FC. But when we first started talking, it was not just about the history that we're going to launch tomorrow night. It's about community centers like this. The fact that this is the third, and there will soon to be six, and the team hasn't played its first game is an indicative of the way the Teppers think about the community and what it is that they're going to do to help us build this great country of ours that's going to have a soccer league that could rival some of the great soccer leagues around the world. So on behalf of everybody who loves this game, who thinks that the United States can be a great soccer nation and really believes that to do that, we need a great team, we need great fans, we need great players, and you need great owners. Uh, we couldn't do anything more than say a heartfelt thanks to all of you. Can't wait for tomorrow night, a network game on Fox, 74,000 uh, people strong, one of the biggest games that will take place in our league history. So thank you to everybody and can't wait for a great future together. Let's have fun. Okay, we have one or two quick things and then we'll wrap up. Um, where is Tim? Is Tim here? Could you come up here, please? Is he here? Tim Hagler. Oh, there he is. Okay, welcome, Tim. All right, we have, we have a really fun announcement. I just want you to stand up here. A couple of things. We talked about if you are a family that's a part of the Camino community and you want to be a player and participate in the practices, this is the, this is the man you need to come see. Okay, we're going to we, – oh, yeah, I'll do it, let you translate. So this is the man to see. <laughs> Si usted es parte de una familia que um, es parte de la familia Camino y quiere jugar aquí, tiene que contactarse con este caballero que se llama Tim Hegler. Okay, so going to come in. The next announcement. We, we are excited um, to offer um, to many of you here, we have, we have a section of free tickets to tomorrow's game that we are going to offer to you. Tenemos una sección de boletos gratis para los que están aquí para el juego de mañana. So if you are interested in that, you're going to come see Tim. <laughs> but that is a simple, a simple gift to get as many families to the game as possible. So we are going to kick this field off with our guest speakers scoring the first goal in this goal right over here. If you would please just back up and we're going to let our, get, our, our speakers shoot a ball into the goal.